Once upon a time, in a quaint village nestled between rolling hills and sparkling streams, there lived a little girl named Lily. Lily was bright-eyed and curious, with a heart full of wonder. Her best friend and constant companion was her grandfather, a wise and kind old man with a twinkle in his eye and a love for stories that seemed almost magical. One summer evening, as the golden sun dipped below the horizon, Grandpop sat in his favorite armchair, knitting together a story for Lily. She snuggled close, eager to hear what adventures awaited. Tonight, Grandpop said with a mischievous grin, I have a special surprise for you. He pulled out an old, leather-bound book with intricate designs on the cover. This is the Book of Worlds. Each page holds a doorway to a different land. Are you ready to explore? Lily's eyes sparkled with excitement. Yes, Grandpop, let's go. Grandpop opened the book to the first page, and as the pages fluttered, a swirling portal appeared. Without hesitation, Lily and Grandpop stepped through. World 1. The forest of whimsy they emerged into a lush, enchanted forest where trees whispered secrets and flowers sang melodies. The inhabitants were playful, talking animals who invited Lily and Grandpop to a grand feast. However, not all was peaceful. The mischievous forest sprites were causing trouble, stealing the magical fruits that kept the forest vibrant. Lily and Grandpop worked together to outweat the sprites, restoring harmony and earning the gratitude of the forest dwellers. World 2. The Floating Isles of Luminera Next, they landed on floating islands suspended in the sky, connected by shimmering bridges of light. The people of Luminera had mastered the art of harnessing starlight to power their homes. But dark clouds had begun to cover the sky, threatening their way of life. Lily discovered that the clouds were caused by a sorrowful star who had lost its way. With Grandpop's guidance, she helped the star find its place in the constellation, and in return, the skies cleared and the people of Luminera celebrated with a grand festival of light. World 3. The underground kingdom of Terra Their next adventure took them deep beneath the earth into the kingdom of Terra, a realm of glowing crystals and subterranean rivers. The kingdom was ruled by a wise but reclusive queen who was troubled by a growing darkness threatening her people. Lily and Grandpop learned that the darkness was a result of a giant, misunderstood mole who was simply searching for a lost gem. By helping the mole find its precious gem, they restored balance to the kingdom and forged a new alliance between the mole and the queen. World 4. The desert oasis of Solara stepping through the portal once more, they found themselves in the sun-drenched desert oasis of Solara, a land of golden sands and ancient ruins. The people of Solara faced a crisis as their magical water sources were drying up. Lily discovered that the source of their water was being blocked by a group of desert-dwelling creatures who had been tricked into thinking the oasis was a threat. 